Hey everyone, got a toolkit for you here. This is a network termination for the RJ45 and I think for the 11 and 12 uh, connectors on this thing. Complete, you're gonna love it, great price. So let's get to the opening of this. Not really too much open boxing on this, but for sure the review. Hi everyone, Captain Mark, Captain Mark Reviews. Today I have a product. It is the RJ45 crimping tool by Sullivan. So let's take a look at this. Okay, see it comes in a nice case to carry it around in. You got all the components inside of it. It's kind of that quarter-ish type material, very firm. And you can see that it's snug and fits everything nice, so it's going to protect it as you're walking around. It has a handle on the end, so you can tote it around. The zipper's pretty sturdy, heavy-duty zipper on that. Not too bad. So I'm going to give you the weight on the case with all the components in it, and it weighs 2.4 pounds. And just to give you some dimensions of this case, it's 8 inches wide by 10 and 3 quarters inch long. And the thickness on it is 3 inches. Okay, let's open this case up, see what's inside, and then we'll get to the review. friend here helping me with the video he's actually an expert on the network cable connector and making cords and doing anything you need for internet and his name is Vic Cavallaro Vic say hi to all my subscribers out there hello you subscribers out there <laughs> I want to thank Captain Mar for allowing me to come out here this morning oh, it's my pleasure Vic my pleasure so Vic this is a Sullivan cable connector kit and it's got many tools in there and you're going to show us how to use it so I'm going to let you go ahead and explain quickly what each of the tools you're going to be using and how you're going to use them for I guess so it's all yours okay well this kit is awesome looking it's got all kinds of stuff for you it's got a Phillips screwdriver it's got a regular screwdriver it's got a cutter that'll cut your cables uh your coax it's got another one that cuts your cable coax this is for your Cat 5. It's a, a cutter and connects it so that you are able to put these co connectors on there. And this will line up the wiring because you'll have some wiring issues. And then we come up with that main thing is the tester. The tester, And yeah. we need that tester to make sure that we do everything and correctly what is it basically, and complete. what is it basically doing? It'll, t it'll tell you if you did your connections correct. Ah. Okay, Vic. So that's pretty good description of the stuff. So why don't you go ahead and do your thing? Okay, let's get started. I'm gonna take this tool right here that cuts and crimps the uh, Cat 5, and we're gonna cut a piece right now. We're gonna demonstrate how good she cuts. Wow, that cut that really quick. Cut it really nice, Pretty really sharp. easy. That's with the cutting tool. And then we can also use this other cable cutter to cut it. And we just want to score the wire. I'm going to score the cable. So it doesn't cut the inner wires? We don't want to cut the inner wires. That's correct. And you, okay, you score it and look at it. You just turn around like this. Oh, wow. You open her up. Man, that cutter did wow. a really good job on that. Yeah. Then we straighten up the cables because we want to make sure they're nice and open, and we we got to get her in that connector there. Mm -hmm. So we which got to separate them. Which connectors are you doing? The we're we're going to use the Cat Five connector. Okay. RG forty fives. Yeah, we got to straighten them all up. So that takes a little bit of time to mm -hmm. straighten them all up. We're going to open up this this uh, connector here, and oh, I tell you what, you got a lot of nice things in here. Yeah, those look at that. Pretty complete. Yeah, pretty nice set. Okay. So this is the RJ forty five. You got to line these up inside the RJ45 in the right order. Wow. Just like that. Wow, I didn't know that. She slides Just all the way slides back. All the way nice through. and tight. Wow, that's cool. Yeah, yeah. Get her right, right in there. 
and grab your crimper tool and Crimpy crimps tool. it and cuts it at the same time. Wow. You'll like it. And you got to make sure you put it in the right one because this is... The right has, one in the right direction. Yeah, this has a six and an eight, <laughs> and this is an eight. Okay. So let's get her Big in the difference. right direction. Big difference. Yeah. All righty. We'll get her in there. Yeah, I appreciate you showing everybody how to use this tool set. This is really cool. I like this set. Yeah, well worth the money. All right, you get it in there, press it in there, get it nice and firm. Wow. Listen to that. It releases wow. it. It cuts it. Look at that. Nice and smooth. Wow. 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 Look, look at that. Look at that. All right. Wow, beautiful. Made a little mess here, but yeah, we're good. We'll clean it up. We'll <laughs> clean it up. Don't worry about that, Vic. It's all part of the job. Okay. Well, now we're going to test it. So we're going to take the cable tester and we're going to put it in one end here. We're going to put it in the other end here. We're going to turn around and see how we did. So what is it doing? It's right now, it's checking all the conductors and making sure we're good to go. And guess what? It's checking all eight of them. Okay. And everything is green. Wow. On both sides. So we've got continuity through each wire then. So that it worked perfect. Wow. Nice job. Good great. job. Yeah. Great kit. Great kit. I like yeah. it. Yeah. Just that simple. So that's how you make a, a CAD5 cable or is a patch cord or internet cable for hooking up in your house. Pretty easy. Vic, that kit makes it real easy. I love it because it just goes through and it cycles and checks every cable, every, I mean, every connector on there. Hmm. And it just shows you that you did a great job. All right. Okay, Vic. Well, thank you so much. I would recommend this uh, kit to anybody who wants to do their own patch cords or internet cords at home, huh? Oh, I love it. Yeah. I love it. It's a great kit. Okay. I'll tell you what, anyone, anybody can do it. If I can do it, you can do it. That's right. We, <laughs> if, if you can do it, I can do it, right? That's right. Okay. Well, thank you, Vic. Thanks for stopping by the Captain Mark studio and uh, showing us how this kit actually works. I well, appreciate it. Thanks for having me. Yeah, no problem. So that's my review on the RJ45 crimping tool kit by Sullivan. It has high leverage and stable ability for all your wiring connections. Whether you want to need to upgrade your network or make fast repairs that will last. It cuts, strips, and terminates the RG11 and 12 and RG45 included with the wires with its precision die heads. The crimping tool is made of professional grade heavy duty steel and delivers exceptional torque without bending. In addition to the crimping abilities, it also cuts and strips, so giving you essentially three tools in one. It's a really nice tool kit. You can pick this up on Amazon for $39.99 and I'll leave that link down below and I think they even have a 10% off on that, so you get a little cheaper than you think. This kit you saw in the video gets the job done and everything you need to complete to get your Wi-Fi up and running, making patch cable cords, phone lines, whatever you need. I'm going to be giving this a Captain Mark's five-star review because it did everything it said it was going to do and this kit does more. And those are the things that I like to bring to you. So if you think the information was useful in helping you purchase this toolkit, or any of the other products on my channel, why don't you give me that big thumbs up? Hey, because it really does help the channel grow. And if you haven't yet, please hit the subscribe button down below and that bell to the right, because if you click it, you can catch all my upcoming videos and there is a lot more coming. Thanks for the questions you guys always ask. I love to try to answer them the best I can. So this is Captain Mark saying, I'll see you in the next one.